Hello and welcome everyone, Gamora here, and we are back with a brand new episode of Let's Play Elden Ring. So without further ado, let's play. Okay, so let's get started. Um, there was something on the map that I, I did see that it's, it's been on the map for quite a long time. Uh, and, you know, eventually we will get to uh, this at some point. But this right here, this uh, request been here for quite a while now how to get here is another question i don't think we can just jump down let's take a look okay so let's see oh no horse i guess i don't think we can just jump down it might be too high Let's take a look anyways. You never know. Oh yeah, this is probably definitely too high. Oh, there's a secret fifth option of NPCs that we haven't seen yet. Okay, so this is... Oh, it's secret. Okay, you got me anyways. Yeah, it doesn't seem like we can make it down from here. Alright. Well, let's go back to the site of grace since we can't teleport with these guys in our way. Must be a different way to get there. Oh, yeah, I guess, I mean, we might have seen this NPC, who knows. So let's see. I guess maybe there's a way under this. It's got to be, right? Oh, you, you got the clean rotten knight's helmet. Nice, congrats. I know you've been working on that for a while. I think what we switched out the, we had the, the chess piece, I believe, and I think I spent a ton of uh, runes to get Radon set. I actually kind of like the cape. Pretty, pretty cool cape. Oh, nice. It has a, even the helmet has a cape. Maybe we'll get lucky and find it as well. I definitely don't want to grind for it. Hold on, am I going in the right direction? I am not going in the right direction. We want to go here. Number three. There we go. Hi, Benny. Welcome to the stream. It's been a while since we, uh, since I've seen you here, pretty much. Ooh, got six people watching. Wow. Right at the start. Thanks for coming to the stream, guys. Those of you chatting, those of you lurking. Yeah, that shouldn't kill us. Probably pretty close. Hey, thanks, Benny, for the like. Okay, so I th we found the marker. And then while we go under the bridge. Man, I hate when you can't open up the map. I kind of wish they'd let us open up the map and just like not let us teleport. That, that I gotta say that is my one of my pet peeves. I mean, at least to my understanding, they don't want you to open up the map when you're in a fight because they don't want you teleporting in the middle of a fight, which I can understand. But uh, sometimes I just want to see the map. Invade Old Knight Istvan's World. Yep, let's do it. This has been on the map for a while. 
You have a feeling one day I'll be I'll be famous. Hopefully just uh, anonymous anonymously famous. That tells me uh I don't know man, sometimes you know, fame is a curse, right? And it seems like a nightmare to have to deal with. I don't know, I'm a very uh someone who likes to stay as private as possible. That's why I don't have a face cam. I mean it took a lot just to get me to talk on the mic. You should have seen me before Before I started doing the let's plays, I would have to like psych myself up just to like have the courage to talk on the mic. Ooh, this guy's not, not a slouch. Good thing these guys only have one flask or else this would be an annoying fight. Got a rune arc. Bring you over is just inhibiting you. Definitely more souls like in my opinion. I have a catchphrase, absolute nightmare. It's a nice I actually look like a nice set of uh armor pieces. I didn't I didn't even realize I said that that often. Something tells me it's probably only a catchphrase, uh when I'm playing Souls games. Probably not something that uh, happens when I play other games. I'm surprised we've never been here. Competitive multiplayer use Duelist furled finger to write a red message sign, a red summon sign. Competitive multiplayer will begin once you have been summoned by a player from another world. You will take the role of an adversary, adversary, duelist, and your objective is to defeat the host of fingers who summoned you. Is this just an arena for PvP fighting? Oh, sure looks like it. To engage in combat with others, touch the effigy of Marika in the Colosseum. Unite combat and combat ordeals can be undertaken in this venue. United combat. In unite com. In united combat, two teams of fighters clash. Combat ordeals are all-out brawls in which every combatant is out for themselves. I don't want to do any PvP at the moment. I feel like we just get trashed like 99% of the time. I'm also pretty terrible at PvP. Although I guess we can check out that armor. Ryoto was cold already. Uh, I think it was scaled. Well, it's heavier than our gauntlets. Well, that's pretty heavy. You know, we need to work on our, uh, we need to put some points in endurance. It's still really low. It's really affecting us. Oh, there's like three or four Colosseums in the game. All right. So now let's, uh, I guess let's look for those, uh, those NPCs that you were talking about, uh, Kitty. I doubt I'm just going to find them on my own. If not, we'll, we could just go here. I don't think I see any other red symbols like that. Or summons. Oh, I forget. Where are they? Bar and Millicent. We should also probably talk to the people at Ronnie's Rise, right? Since we did do something over here.
Let's see what uh what she has to say to us. Although I did she did say she was gonna be sleeping, so I don't know. Maybe she's asleep. Oh Var Oh she, she's at the Rose Church. Okay. Let's see what uh what this lady's gonna say, if she's even awake. Okay, well, that was a quick thing to check. The Rose Church. Oh, let's see if I can find it, Rose. Get where it is. It doesn't have I can wonder I was oh it's this one right here huh there it is right this is the one we found or oh, this is the one someone else uh, uh fudge helped me find because I just completely missed it and Melisint is overlooking the Cliffs at Bird Tree in Atlas, but in the Atlas Plateau. Or we'll do that after this. All right, it's it's this dude, right? Oh, Lambkin, so pleased you're here. I'm glad that you're enjoying my gift. Mm. I knew it from the very start. You have a taste for noble blood. <clears throat> I wish to anoint you a proper inductee. A knight to serve Luminary Moog, the Lord of Blood, and establish a new dynasty. Luminary Moog has strength, vision, and, of course, love. So, what do you say, my lambkin? Usually it's a good idea to say yes to pretty much everything in, uh, Souls games. Hmm, yes. Who would have it any other way? Now, take this. The Lord of Blood's favor. For your final trial, soak the cloth with a maiden's blood. Normally, this ritual would involve killing one's own maiden and recanting the wisdom of the two fingers. But since you are maidenless, the blood of anyone's maiden will do. I thought... I thought I had a maiden. Wasn't she the one who gave me the horse? The cloth is your final trial. Soak it with the blood of anyone... Oh, I think we fought that dude the last stream, if I'm not mistaken. I think it was... Somewhere in this area. Oh, wait. No, it was in Kaleed, was it? No. That was over here. Was it that church? Maybe it was this church? Oh, so I'm not crazy. We do have a maiden. Yeah, I think this is the one. At least if I'm thinking of the right. If I'm thinking of the right uh, person. Oh, yeah, we are. The Lord of Blood's favor. I guess she, pretty, she is important. I knew she was kind of strange. Just sitting there doing nothing. And we didn't even have to kill anybody. She was already dead. At least I think she's dead. You never know with this kind of game. Well, 
That's interesting. I didn't realize that there are more maidens that you can use. Wait a minute. Oh yeah, I, I forgot that I we did that uh at the at the end of the stream we did that dragon glitch. But I guess we already consumed the runes. Ah, my lambkin. You've completed your final trial, and with this, you are a formal inductee, a knight who will assist Luminary Moog, the Lord of Blood, in the establishment of a new dynasty. Now, give me your finger. This noble blood will be an immutable badge of honor once it settles inside of you. Well, let's hope you don't cut my finger off. Or am I going to cut my own? Oh, good heavens. Clench your teeth or something. Bloody finger. Let's hope that's not mine, but something tells me it is. Never forget that feeling of agony, for it is what binds you to Luminary Moog, to all of us. <laughs> you have the sweetest scream, my lambkin. Uh, that's an interesting theory. wonder if it's backed up with any lore... Are people just speculating? Oh, another thing. You should have this. The Pure Blood Knight's Medal. Cool. I don't know if that's a good medal, but it definitely looks interesting. A medal granted by the new Moguin Dynasty. With the power to grant audience with Luminary Moog. I've gone out of my way to provide one to you. But you mustn't use it just yet. The meeting must wait until the Moguin dynasty commences. Luminary Moog yet slumbers beside the divinity. We must endure a little longer. Let's take a look at this really quick. Uh... Italian... Oh, that's not medallions. What am I doing? So many of these menus. Sometimes it's hard to remember where stuff is. Oh, wait, was that not a medallion? Or, I mean, uh, a talisman. Oh, I see, I see. I thought it was... I guess I... I guess I looked up the... I guess I misremembered what the symbol was. Okay, forget it. Ah, it is trying. But we must be patient. One day you will be elevated, deservedly, basking in love. Right, my lambkin? <laughs> oh, it's a usable item and tools? Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Though we probably won't use it right now. Ah, it is one day. Right, my lambkin? <laughs> okay, so that's that. Now to, now to the Atlas place. There was one thing I wanted to check. Don't remember where it was. I think it was down here. Was it inside of this? So strange, I don't remember. I think it was up these waters. Was that the third way to uh, Atlas? Because that was a way we never went.
Probably I'll look at the map and see if it jars my memory. For some reason, it is not. I think I wanted to do this. It's got to be like right here, right? Kind of like in this area. Yeah, I started going that way, what, yesterday's stream, and then I kind of turned around. I think it was in this direction. Yeah, it's definitely a, an area that I, I want to, like you said, uh, like what you said, Millicent. Millicent is in... In the, in the atlas what is it atlas plateau or something yeah what was that probably catapult oh i see that's all good i wasn't expecting to get a uh, a hundred percent on these uh you know, quest lines. Not too surprising. That's why I really don't consider people telling me about it a spoiler. Because we, more than likely I wouldn't have found any of these uh, NPCs. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Damn it. I thought I was, I was fine from that height. And sometimes jumping on those platforms with a horse be kind of sketchy. Oh well. Light of Grace is not too far. Not that big a deal. Let's just hope we're going in the right direction. Oh, we screwed up Patches storyline? Oh, that's fine. I can care less about Patches. No. That's what I mean about these sketchy jumps. Ooh. And I think we just died again. Oh god. Thankfully we caught those uh those ledges. I think it was in this direction if I'm not mistaken. Hey lightning shot. Welcome to the stream. How you guys doing? Or how are you doing specifically? Right. Oh, his, of course, his quest gives you the best armor in the game. That's fine. I feel like armor is not really that important. Like, like the second to best armor is probably more than enough anyways. Or really anything. I think I, I mainly focus on how it looks more than anything. Could have got this from the beginning. I think you did mention uh, when I came in this direction that there was a, a site of grace. We should have just came and picked it up. Okay, so let's uh, go. I guess in this direction. I don't know. Number three. Oh, almost missed this ladder. Let's see where this takes us. Lightning and Jolteon in the same chat. There's somebody here named Jolteon. Okay, then, uh, poison ahead. Seek incantation. Ah, 
Or we could just burn them to the ground. That's pretty easy. I don't know where this is going to take us, but let's keep going. Maybe we'll find some items. Secret tunnel. Oh, we're going to find some, uh, some smithing stone in here. Didn't realize it was one of those tunnels. Oh, we definitely want to build or get as many as we can. Because we definitely will be switching weapons at some point. Don't know when. Is that ladder that you're talking about, Kitty, for like a secret dungeon or something? Okay, so that's wonderful. At least it's just poison. Could be worse. I think I actually might have something for it. And there we go. Poison gone. Although we don't have that many of them. Maybe I should have just... Uh, dealt with the poison. It's not like it's that big a deal. Be wary of poison. Well, a little too late for that message. I probably would have fell for that trap anyways. Ooh. I was too busy reading the message. I didn't even realize what was going on. That was just for new items. Behold hole. You know those weapons? I never gave those weapons a shot. Maybe we should, huh? There's like a couple weapons that we got pretty high up. Let's give it a shot. Now that we're not in bad territories, I guess. We can do that. And are we fat? Rolling? No, we're still medium. But if I do, that'll make us heavy. Okay, let's not, not do that. Okay, so I think we, no, we don't think we can just, oh, we're going up. For a second, I thought we were going down. Oh, is this the weapon you were talking about? I didn't realize it was a different name. I just kind of assumed it was this one. I definitely do want to find a good uh, spear or halberd or whatever. I wonder if this uh, still bounces off of them. Ooh. Well, it's not the best. Definitely not a one shot, even the jump attack. That stuns him. Does use FP, but I'll take it. Not that much FP, but still good. Still a good attack. It'd be nice if it was a one shot. Oh, I see. Yeah, I should definitely play around with uh, weapon combos. I should, I should even try putting on some weapons that maybe I don't think are that good. Just to see what the... You know, the, uh, the weapon skill is. There's bound to be some good weapon skills that I'm just kind of not looking into. Because I'm just not interested in the weapon. Okay, well. Should have known that was going to happen. Ooh, hold on, hold on. Definitely don't want to die.
Not bad, but 300 damage on those guys. All for some lightning grease. But a waste of time for that item. Okay, then, uh... Let's see what we got going on up here. Just chilling. Ooh. Probably should have killed the other dudes before I woke that dude up. Hate these guys. Really quick and really annoying. Thanks for bunching up like that for me. You made it really easy to kill you. Are you talking about like energy beams or something with the great sword? That kind of shoot out the light. No fingers ahead, but all a hole. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you are enjoying these episodes, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And come check out the live streams on YouTube and Twitch.